A week from tonight, the college baseball season could be over. Now, some dreams have already been made and some broken in Omaha. While there are only a handful of teams left playing, we'll keep these power rankings at a nice even 10. Just looks better, right? A couple of retreads start off in our lowest two spots. At number 10, Old Miss. The loss to Tennessee Tech, more of an outlier for one of the best seasons in college baseball. And at number 9, Stanford. Same thing with the Cardinal. Unfortunate luck in the regional doesn't take away from the fact that Stanford won the Pac-12 and was on par with Florida all season. All right, now to number eight, Washington. The first of the departed from the College World Series. The Huskies performed admirably in their first Omaha appearance. But after a shutout loss to the hands of Mississippi State, they ran into the juggernaut offense of Oregon State last night. At number seven, Texas. Similar tough situation for the Longhorns. The rain delay in the opener led to an explosion of offense for a potent Arkansas team. Then Texas, they had to take on the defending national champs with their backs against the wall. At number six, North Carolina. The Tar Heels hadn't lost a single game in the NCAA tournament until today, but fell in a big way to Mississippi State. The Tar Heels' lack of pitching depth may come back to hurt them. Now they have to play tomorrow night against Oregon State, and then potentially two more against Mississippi State. At number five, Florida. Yes, for the first time all year, the Gators slipped from the number one spot after their loss to Texas Tech. Now, Florida may still be the best team in baseball, but right now, at this very moment, they fall below teams who sit in a better position to win the national title. At number four, Mississippi State. The Bulldogs had to sweep Florida in the final weekend of the season to simply have a chance to make it into the NCAA tournament field. Now they're in the driver's seat and just one win from a berth in a championship series after the eight-run eighth inning blew open the game against North Carolina. And number three, Oregon State. It was an uncharacteristic day featuring three errors in the loss to North Carolina that put Oregon State in the loser's bracket, but the Beavers flashed their full array of potent offense with 14 runs on 16 hits against Washington. Number two, Texas Tech. Now, it seems like powerful offense has been the key so far to success in Omaha, and the Red Raiders got to one of the best pitchers in baseball in their win over Florida on Sunday night. And number one, Arkansas. The Razorbacks have now put up 14 runs and 11 runs in their last two games and have the hottest offense in college baseball. They're number one for now. And those are the Sports Tonight NCAA Baseball Power Rankings. Tonight's NCAA Baseball Power Rankings are brought to you by IHOP home of the new Ultimate Steak Burger Combos starting at $6.99.